And next up is the women's 800 metres T54. And they're away. Gulyavan 1, Kotorova 2, Lou 3, Scaroni 4, Vandenbroek 5, Zhu 6, McFadden 7, and Wallengren in lane 8. And look at Lou go in lane 3, the 100 metres champion. She's fastest over 100 metres here as well, certainly. And the other Chinese Zhu is certainly up in second place at the moment. McFadden fighting with her back there in third place. And also for the Netherlands, Vandenbroek is coming good. Gulyavan is defending a line very well for Russia at the moment as they all come inside it's China one and two at the moment who is leading Zhu quarter way point of the race China one and two but the Dutch athlete Vandenbroek made a, a very good move just to try and cover the Chinese move she's lying in third place McFadden's there in fourth Wallengren on the outside for Sweden in fifth place but all quite congested as they take the bell it's Zhu for China it's Lou for China in second place. McFadden up in third place. On her inside and fourth is Vandenbroek on McFadden's outside is Wallengren for Sweden in fifth place. The other American, Scaroni, is tucked in behind, but it's China one and two. A big early move by Lou. It'll take a lot to shake her off now. Will the other Chinese Zhu try and make any kind of a move to overtake her at all? It's China one and two. It's teamwork at the moment. It's a good gap back to third place in Vandenbroek. McFadden has fallen back. It's all very heavily punched. The real race now is for third place. The big question, is Zhu going to try and overtake Lu? We saw this in Beijing in the walk, and the Chinese broke away very early, and there was no real racing after that, and there won't be here. It's going to be gold. It's Zhu who will take it. It's Lu in second place, and in third will be Vandenbroek. Might just have been Gulieva to take fourth in the line, but it is Zhu who comes through to take the win, and Lu not really making an attempt once they'd got into position to try and overtake. So Zhu Leong is the world champion, and she joins Lu on one gold medal this week. Margaret Vandenbroek of the Netherlands takes the bronze. Zhu Leong, our winner, 151.13, the winning time. And we've seen that, haven't we? It's happened in the the tie races have been very similar to the way they were to it with each other. But Zhu, Li Hong, and Lu Wen Jun, as they came down to the line, there was no attempt whatsoever from Lu to go past her compatriot. It was almost as if they decided that if one of you get to the front, I'm going to stay behind you and we'll work, work it like that. But it was an outstanding effort. They got away very early and there was no catching them from around the 250 metre mark. Away they went. And it was a case then to see who was going to get the bronze medal. So there was no attempt by Lou to get out of the slipstream of Zoo. Once they'd broken clear, it was going to stay like that. And I don't know if that was preordained between the two in advance, specifically for this race, or if it's something that's a bit more established in Chinese sporting culture, but it's Zhu with gold, Lu with silver, and Vandenbroek gets the bronze. PBs for Kotorova in fourth for Russia, and Gulieva in fifth for Russia. <laughs>